China is a huge tourism destination with many possibilities. This country offers amazing sights and experiences. Whether you cruise down the Yangtze Gorges, visit a bustling city, or relax in an ancient temple, our top Chinese tourist attractions list features unique, unexpected, and exciting activities. Number 10. Shanghai's Promenade, The Bund. Shanghai's Zhongshanlu Riverside Promenade, also known as The Bund, is a marvel of smart city planning and preservation. This spacious pedestrian zone along the Huangpujiang River makes you forget you're in China's largest city. The Bund is known for its 52 maintained English and French influenced buildings, many of which are restaurants, cafes, retailers, and art galleries. The old waterfront customs office, with its bell tower, the 468 meter Oriental Pearl Tower across the Huangpujiang River offers the best Bund views. Visit the Yu Garden if time permits. The Garden of Bliss was laid out in 1559 and is a must-see. Several original structures remain. Number 9. The Padala Palace, Tibet. Lhasa's Padala Palace is another famous Chinese landmark. It was the Dalai Lama's fortress and dwelling for centuries and holds many of the religion's most valuable relics. The 17th century Red Palace houses the complex's most prominent shrines. The enthronement hall has murals of Dalai Lamas and Tibetan kings on its walls. The Red Palace's many large chambers dedicated to the religion's teachings and the Dalai Lama's magnificent tombs are also noteworthy. The similarly beautiful White Palace was finished in 1648 and features sleeping quarters, studies, and reception rooms, most unchanged since 1959 when the Dalai Lama fled Tibet. See Lhasa's stunning gem gardens. The Dalai Lama's summer retreat. These 90-acre gardens were started in the 1840 and include palaces, pavilions, and lakes. Number 8. The Classical Gardens of Suzhou, Jiangsu. A UNESCO World Heritage Site, should top of your China trip agenda. These exquisite gardens in Suzhou, Jiangsu Province, were among 270 or more planted in the 11th century, when TH City was growing rapidly. The most famous restored garden is the Charming Garden of Lingering, a seven-acre site built in 1800 on the site of a Ming Dynasty park. The garden, one of China's most famous, has a pool, numerous gorgeous buildings, a man-made hill, a peach grove, and a lovely covered pathway with more than 300 stone tablets etched with traditional Chinese characters. Number 7. The Yangtze River and the Three Gorges. The Yangtze River, known in China as Changjiang, is the third longest river in the world after the Amazon and the Nile and the longest in China. For over 2,000 years, China's main transportation artery, the Yangtze, has flowed from Tibet to Shanghai through eight provinces. Its 700 tributaries cover one-fifth of the country and a quarter of its agricultural land. The Three Gorges, a 200-kilometer stretch between Fingjia and Ichang, the river winds through gorges with rocky rocks and towering mountain peaks in a length as stunning as the Grand Canyon. Number 6. Chengdu Research Base of Giant Panda Breeding, Sichuan. Pandas are essential to any Chinese trip. The research base of giant panda breeding in Chengdu, Sichuan, is the ideal spot to witness these remarkable animals in their natural habitat. You can watch 80 pandas forage and play in this park like facility. In addition to seeing these beautiful animals up close, you'll learn a lot about them from the many permanent exhibits and displays regarding conservation initiatives. Number 5. Cruising the Li River, Gilan. Gilan, in northeast Guangxi, is noted for its Li River and Karst Mountains. For centuries, poets, artists, and fairy tales have been inspired by its unique environment. Now, travelers from over the world come to see it. Cruise the Li River to appreciate the region. The most popular length is from Gilan to Yangshua, where the river flows gently over 80 kilometers of stunning rock formations and caverns with romantic names like the Peak of Exceptional Beauty, Elephant Trunk Hill, and Reed Flute Cave. From tourist cruise ships to bamboo punts, journeys might last a few hours to many days. Number 4. The Summer Palace, Beijing. The Imperial Summer Palace, Iha Yuan, one of China's most visited sites, is a 15-kilometer drive from Beijing. The palace was established in 1153, but its enormous lake was added in the 14th century to improve the imperial gardens. The Hall of Benevolence and Longevity, Rinshou Dian, with its throne and the Grand Theater, 
a private three-story edifice built in 1891 to fulfill the imperial family's opera passion, are highlights. Visit this historic venue for traditional Chinese dramas and musical performances. Number 3. The Terracotta Army, Xi'an. Farmers found the Terracotta Army in the 1970s while excavating wells outside Xi'an. The three massive underground pits, erected to guard the first emperor's tomb, contained more than 8,000 life-size warriors, 520 horses, and 100 chariots. Many of the statues uncovered have been painstakingly reassembled, demonstrating the emperor's and afterlife's prominence. The site, part of the Emperor Qin Shi Huang's Mausoleum Site Park, is one of China's most popular tourist attractions and offers the amazing experience of inspecting a centuries-old procession of troops and horses. Number 2. The Forbidden City and Amp, the Imperial Palace, Beijing. Beijing's Forbidden City, Zijincheng, commonly known as the Imperial Palace, is China's largest and most important building. The complex was built between 1406 and 1420 during the Yuan Dynasty. This sprawling compound housed 24 Ming and Qing emperors, who barred admission to all but the imperial family and their courtesans. This vast complex includes ceremonial, administrative, and the emperor's private home on 720,000 square meters, defended by a 10-meter-high wall with watchtowers and a wide moat. While it can take many hours to see everything, highlights include the five white marble Golden River Bridges, the Hall of Supreme Harmony, a 35-meter tall building housing the Imperial Throne, the exquisite Emperor's Banquet Hall, and the Palace Museum with its large collection of Ming and Qing Dynasty art and artifacts. Number 1. The Great Wall of China. The Chinese phrase, nobody can be a true hero unless he has gone on the Great Wall, shows the importance of this remarkable ancient landmark. The magnificent Great Wall of China, known in Chinese as Chongqing or the Long Wall, stretches more than 6,000 kilometers from the fortresses of Shanhaiguan in the east to Jiaguan in the west, passing through Hebei, Tientsin, Beijing, Inner Mongolia, Ningxia, and Gansu. The wall has many battlements and watchtowers, ranging from 6 to 8 meters to 16 meters and big enough for 5 horses or 10 men to pass. The wall's best, known parts were added around 210 BC when its numerous sections were linked together. What do you think about our video? Please let us know in the comments area below. If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear from us again, please subscribe and turn on the notification before leaving. Thank you for watching us.